What is up, Jamly? This is JamiraFan2000 here with yet another episode of JamiraFan Talks About. This, of course, has been my reoccurring series where I basically look at everything about Jamiroquai in a discussionary series from the past, present, and future. And so far, there are over 28 years of music making. Now, this episode is going to be kind of a little bit inter a little bit interesting and different. But uh, most recently, uh, one of my fellow Jamiroquai fans... Uh, decided to try remastering some of the uh, Jamiroquai music videos, and so far the results have been pretty astounding. Um, and uh, this is not the first time we've seen the Jamiroquai musical vi videography actually remastered, or at least attempted to be remastered and put onto a digital format. Uh, back in 2006, you might remember, Jamiroquai did leave their uh, whole record label of Sony Music for Universal Music in 2006. Um, after very you know, JK has always been vocal in the in the future uh, in the past about the intrusiveness of record labels in the music making process. And in the pro in the in the case of Jamiroquai, after they hit pay dirt with a, a million eleven million album sales of Traveling Without Moving in 1996 into 97, um, Sony just continued to be very disruptive to JK and the band during the music making process. So that ultimately made JK want to leave Sony. So as part of an agreement to leave Sony Music out of their eight album deal. Um, Jamiroquai released a High Times Greatest Hits compilation on CD and, of course, on DVD, which was the first real coupling of all the Jamiroquai music videos available up to that time point into one DVD release. Now, um, there is a lot of great old Jamiroquai music videos, most notably from Mercy Planet Earth, probably up to, I want to say, Synchronized. That could could greatly benefit from a great remastering, either in 4K or 1080p HD. Um and uh, I just thought I'd record a Jamiro fan talks about to look at should the Jamiro Kwai musical music videography be updated, be remastered for video clarity and uh, up converted to 4K uh, for a future release through um, p potentially Sony music, given that a majority of those music videos were made during uh, Jamiro uh, uh tenure uh, producing albums for Sony music. Now, I think there is a market definitely for members of the Jamly who want to have HD quality upgrades or up conversions of old Jamiroquai music videos. Now, I I do think maybe a hand of a fan, I hate to put it, but I have to use, do that rhyme time, but a hand of the fan potentially helping Sony Music and potentially remastering the music videos for at least for a Blu-ray or maybe DVD release, um, maybe a one-off release of all the Jamiroquai music videos um, being remastered would be very, very beneficial. Um, and it's not the first time Jamiroquai has not, has a uh, Jamiroquai or Jamiroquai's original record label has not, been dependent on fans to help them facilitate uh, a lot of stuff. Most notably, uh, a lot of fans did help out uh, Jamira Kawhi Limited and Sony on the uh, the upkeep of their official websites during literally three album eras. So I do think Sony Music could uh, could potentially m strike a deal with a fan or somebody to help them consult into potential remastering of music videos for Jamira Kawhi in a future DVD or oh, hey, I love to see it Blu-ray release of all the Jamira Kawhi music videos. Um, another thing I should point out is uh, this is not the first time that I've reported news about a Jamiroquai music video being potentially remastered. Now, you might remember about two months ago, um, I came across, or I should say some members of the Jamly came across, uh, pictures of apparently a uh, of a 4K HD upgrade of Jamiroquai's seminal music video, Virtual Insanity, from 1996, that was currently being done by a, a company, um, by a UK company, uh, under the uh, commission of Sony Music Limited. So... I have not gotten any more news about that uh, that remastering of Virtual Insanity, but some pictures were posted on Facebook from that company that was doing the uh, chief um, publishing and remastering of the Virtual Insanity music video, and it looked completely starkly different from the original standard uh, standard or the SD version of Virtual Insanity that we've all come to know. Um, but uh, if I get any more news concerning that, Separately, concerning that music, uh, that virtual insanity remastering into 4K, I'll be sure to pass it on in my other series, the Jamir Kawhi Minute, as soon as possible once I get more news. But uh, I leave the question to you, members of the Jamly. I'm most interested in hearing your opinions. Would you be interested in buying a potential 4K or 1080p up conversion Blu ray release of all the Jamir Kawhi music videos, at least under the purview of Sony Music? So that would be from 1992 to 2006. Would you pay to see a Blu ray release of 
upconverted, high definition remastered music videos from Jamiroquai's uh, music videography. I am most interested in hearing all your opinions on this topic. Please feel free to leave your opinions down in the YouTube comments section down below. I'm most interested in reading all your opinions on that. And if any more, if any more details about this this fan, my fan friend of mine who is, is trying to spearhead a bit of a Sony project and getting the Jamiroquai music videography uh, remastered in 4K or potentially 1080p HD for any type for any type of future release. I'll be sure to pass on the information that is appropriate and pertinent to the story whenever it becomes available. But as always, this is uh, Jamera Fan 2000. I hope you enjoyed this, ep this special episode of Jamera Fan Talks About. Be sure to like and subscribe. Be sure to ding the bell on your YouTube to stay up to date on all the latest new content coming out of the Jamera Fan 2000 YouTube channel and all the latest new content concerning Jamera Kwai and any more news that comes available. But as always, this is Jamera Fan 2000. And I'll see you again soon with more Jamera Kwai related videos here on the Jamera Fan 2000 YouTube channel. Bye-bye, everybody, and stay safe.